Welcome back to the Ghost Key. I am Gray, and today we welcome the Dirt Machine. While we were away and I was grinding everybody up, I decided to go catch a sand shrew. Now I know I said I wanted to go ahead and try and catch as much shit on screen as possible, but I was just taking too long last time, so I decided to just go ahead, pick up Dirt Machine here, and I'll take a look at him. He has a relaxed nature, nothing all that great. Just, you know, good attack, good defense. He has Sand Veil, so we're gonna have to go get ourselves Sandstorm or find Sandstorm on somebody to make him just destroy shit. Obviously at some point we're gonna put EQ on him as well and let him hold the Earthquake, Sandstorm. Um, he's not really got much, he's just got Poison Sting, Sand Attack. I want at least Earthquake, Sandstorm, Sand Attack on him, that way he will pretty much be unstoppable. I know we get Sandstorm in Victory Road or some shit later. So we're gonna have to wait a while to get that unless we can find a setup Pokemon for him. I'll have to do a little bit of looking into that over the next few days, whatnot. See if we can find one. Alright, anyway. We got Granker up to level 19. Oh, speaking of, way back in episode 2, the title kinda gives it away, but I was calling everybody level 19 when they were really level 9. See how smart I am? Yeah, I'm, I'm intelligent, right? He's got the lonely nature. Great attack, crap for defense, obviously. Good good speed, though. He's, he's pretty good. Vital Spirit is his ability, which eh, could come in handy. As long as we don't run up against anything, that'll put him to sleep. But then again, it's not like he's going to run up and run through like any ghost-type Pokemon or anything like that, because they'll just rock his world. He's rocking Mega Punch and Mega Kick and Low Kick and Karate Chop. Cause that's what we do on Granker or something. I don't know. Alright. Pidgeotto, our wonderfully named Stella. She's got the quiet nature. She's holding Keen Eye right now, which obviously you see what it does. That's that's good shit. Yeah, halfway decent attack. Yeah, decent speed. Nothing great. Um Picked up Whirlwind, I believe, while I was grinding. I think that's the one I meant. So I replaced Tackle with that. I, I have favorite Quick Attack. It does more damage. Um, just got the basic Flying Gust. I'll probably swap that out for Fly at some point. And, of course, Sand Attack. You know how I like Sand Attack. Although I haven't been using it all that much. But, you know, that's that's going to change here. All right, Mokana. Oh, uh, Mokana, we've got Overgrow. Oh, and uh, Bashful Nature. I don't even know what that one really does. I'll have to go take a look. Good special attack, which he's just got Leech Seed, Vine Whip, Poison Powder, and Tackle right now. To go take a look, see what he learns in Gen 3. I'm not entirely sure, but we'll go take a look. Anyway, today what we're going to do is we are going to head on up through the infamous Mew Bridge, or as I call it, the Mew Bridge, because this is where you can do that little cheat thing and get the Mew and all that stuff. You remember that? Yeah, alright, yeah, it's right over in that grass over there. So we got a little bug catcher right here. We're gonna swap out and, and lead with Stella. I have no idea what that other girl has, but... Um, I didn't quite level, um... Uh, Dirt Machine and Granker all the way up to level 20 because... We're gonna... We're probably gonna pick up some levels for them through here. Or at least a few, and if I remember right, our badge only takes us up to 30. So I'm probably just gonna hang out around there for everybody right about now. I'll keep them within a few levels. And I'm gonna probably use Granker, or lean on Granker and um, Dirt Machine for Lieutenant Surge, who is our next gym battle. So I didn't really wanna risk, I know it's only one level, but I really didn't wanna push them too far and run that risk of them, you know, not listening to us when we need him for Lieutenant Surge, which is also one of the reasons why I picked up Sandshrew mostly for Lieutenant Surge, although he doesn't have a ground type move. However, his, you know, just his ability to not get rocked by all that electric shit is, you know, nice. Anyway, other than that, like I said, I think we're just gonna probably. Oops, I don't wanna fucking do that, I ain't paying attention. Probably just gonna run through the bridge here. Um, we gotta go do the whole bill thing, if you remember, so we can go ahead and get the little pass for the SSN and get on down the 
Oh, the hell that it places God with Lieutenant Surge. So, yeah, we do have a lot of battling coming up. So it's gonna be it's gonna be a bit of a bit of a trek here. The next couple episodes, I'm gonna try and shorten them up. By the way, next couple, eh, she present herself again, man. That's just some fucked up shit right there. Next few episodes are gonna be a lot of battling, and they're probably gonna be shorter because of that. I don't really want to go in here and make you sit through 30 minutes of battling, although you could get it all done with and all that shit. But like I said, I'm gonna try and shorten the episodes so you don't have to sit there and, and really stomach through that. And I know I'm just, you know, using the scratch. I need to put, I think I got a rock to him. I need to go take a look at that after this fight and see what I can put on, on Dirt Machine here so we can take out bird types. Because him being ground, kind of, I kind of work out a little We don't want that out there. Mm -mm. Still, Dirt Machine. I like Dirt Machine. Dirt Machine's a good name for, for Sandshrew. It's kind of what I call my dog. It's fucking Dirt Machine. It's a she, but I give her like this bubble voice all the time. She's like, I'm gonna talk like this all the time. Because she just has that derpy fucking, that derpy thing about her, you know what I mean? Bellsprout. Fucking Bellsprout. Oh, there goes the air conditioning. I wonder if you can hear that. I hope not. Shit. I don't even really need air conditioning today. It's kind of nice outside. Which is weird for me because I'm not an outdoorsy person. But anyway. Come on, hurry up. Let's go with this guy. Here's number three. It won't be easy. Oh no. Like, I can't go back and fucking heal. I'm pretty sure you can. Oh, look at the Sancher. I had some Sancher on Sancher action. Actually, I'm gonna swap out to. I'm gonna go in here and get out there and take care of that. He should be alright. We should have some evolutions here soon, probably when we get to the SSN, because I know these guys are mostly all lower level. Probably could be using like the Mega Kick and shit, but like those those sorts of moves scare the shit out of me when they don't freaking like hit. Like I know Mega Kick has, you know, does like what, 120 power, but has only like a 75% hit chance and it fucks your shit up if you miss, I think. I think it does that. I don't know, I never used Mega Kick much or Mega Punch. But if he's just gonna D curl here and just friggin' kick his ass. That kittens. What do we want to do with that kittens? Let's. I'm gonna one with Stella right now on, on that Atkins. See if we can't. See if we can't get her to Oko this little shit. Fuck, I didn't know to use a little one. I'm a fucking dumbass. God damn it. Yeah, they failed. That's also one reason why I held on, or decided to go with Whirlwind over Tackle. Quick Attack does more damage. It's priority. And Whirlwind has that ability to swap something out. If they get something out. Or get something else to switch into. So that could come in handy if we get ourselves into a position that, you know, don't want to waste a turn and want to swap into something we can take on. It might work out, but it also all depends on if I remember that shit and I think about it and I strategize for that sort of shit. Is I usually don't. There's a guy over there in the grass. There's that little little lass again. This game's incredibly incredibly suggestive. Let's see. Let's guess this little shit. No, oh, that did a lot more than I hoped it would. So I was, uh, I, I was, I'm uh, gonna do the other one. Let's, let's switch, see if I can, see if Karanku can do alright here. Should be, I don't know if they get their ground typing yet. I think they're just poison at this point. I could be wrong though. No. I don't, I don't really know what everyone's typing is in Gen 3. But, um, yeah, going forward, uh, I was, I was thinking about this the other day, and I think I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and, and do some football manager tutorials just for the hell of it, just for just to get those out of the way. And then when football manager 2015 comes out, then I'll 
I'm, I'll go ahead and do an LP of that because, as I said before, I'm, I'm a bit of a sports person. Kind of the opposite of most LPers that do Pokemon and shit. Uh, they're all closed off and don't really know anything about sports and shit like that, or don't really pay attention to that stuff. I, I do. And, you know, LeBroning is sort of a thing now, and it's quite entertaining. I am not a fan of, of LeBron, by the way. So, you know, I, I may I may just name a derpy Pokemon. Ooh, like a Dunsparce would be great. LeBron, little little LeBron there running, running through shit. And <laughs> the good thing is, god damn, good old Avast popping up and shit while I'm recording. That's the second time now. I'm gonna have to... You know, make sure that shit don't happen. What I'll do to make sure that shit don't happen, I don't know, but... Yeah, gimme, give gimme give the fabulous nugget. Yeah, ooh. Now, it's another thing that I'll forget to... Oh, wanna join? Are you sure? I, I would say yes! I would say yes to joining Team Rocket! No, I don't... I, I, I said yes! I don't... No, fuck you, asshole. Fucking Ekans. Fucking heck, should we... Should we just let Stella run boss on this? Like she's been doing it all day long. She's gonna... Straight boss and shit up all night. All night? All day. It's not even night yet. Oh, poison. Oh, fuck. I always forget about that shit. Like, oh! I would just tear this shit up that I get poison. God damn it. Just gusting her She's just straight bossing right now. Just bossing, bossing, bossing. Get out, asshole. See, yeah, and that's one of the things that I'm kind of worried about is, you know, she's level 22 already, like I said, I think I go through the SSN still, too. If memory serves me right. I mean, we get more trainers, and a bunch more trainers after this, after we do... We're on our way to the bill thing, because it's, yeah, we gotta do all that shit. And that's not gonna be... It's not gonna be fun for you guys. I enjoy it. I enjoy grinding just because, I mean... Like, when you, when you watch LPers grind, and not really grind, but fight trainers, you see you see more of their strategy. I mean, I know a lot of people want to get to, like, the exciting stuff and all that shit, but, you know, this is really just, you know, this is where you see how, you know, their strategies really come out and come into play and stuff like that, and you kind of find out more, ooh, a trap. You find out a lot more about about the LPRs that way, I think, in seeing them, you know, battle instead of just, oh shit, it's an important battle, now I gotta do something, you know, play a little different. How they handle just the normal, normal shit that they run up against, because, you know, it's, I mean, I'm sure some of them do, like, actually remember what Pokemon all these little scrub trainers have, but I sure shit don't, and, you know, seeing how people deal with that randomness, you know, really helps, because, I mean, obviously, you go through the whole game pretty much, uh, building your squad to take on the Elite Four, at least I do anyway. But, anyway, I'll, I'll continue this conversation next time as we continue on to Bill's house. This seems like a pretty good spot to stop right now. We just got done with the bridge, the Nugget Bridge. There you go, that's a good term for it, Nugget Bridge. That's what people call it, isn't it? Anyway, I'm done for now. Um, I think that's it. Yeah, I don't have anything else to say other than, um, you know, See you next time. Subscribe and comment and do all that shit. Pants are optional. <laughs>